Welcome to part 4, the conclusion of Pecking Chickens 2.0. Let's begin by putting sauce on our completed chickens. Today's episode brought to you by Noah. Lovely. Let's now get our paddle ready. Start by locating and drilling your dowel holes. All right, I'm gonna start kind of shallow and th then I can adjust my depth stop as needed. Our bird is up way too high. And I can go quite a bit deeper still. Here, let's get keep that set a little deeper. Let's see how that looks. That's probably too deep. We'll back off a little bit. All right, and check our depth. Oh, that looks pretty good. All right, I've got all the holes drilled where the chickens go. The small holes are for the dowels. The larger holes are the string holes, and those go all the way through. The centers of the two holes are spaced 5 eighths of an inch apart. Hmm, what could I add to this to make it a little bit cooler? Oh, I know, a woodpecker on a lamp post. As you can see, the ball in the lamp post was carved and placed with a knife, and it took around an hour and a half to both carve and then sand the ball. To create a pattern for the woodpecker, I just altered some clip art. An eye screw will guide the string coming out of the woodpecker. Ah. 
I'll use two separate weights to drive the nine strings of the paddle. One for the left and one for the right half. The weight should be so that it brings the heads to just about the balancing point. In the case of cedar or pine, that weight is about eight or nine grams. Click here for more information on how these were made. Adjust the strings so that the weight is centered and hangs about four and a half inches below the paddle. Like we did on the heads, use scrap to wedge the strings into the holes, cut the scrap flush, and apply super glue. I finally got there. She is done. Now, our original question was, can we improve upon and, in fact, make cooler the pecking chicken's toy? The answer to our question is, <laughs> is hell yeah. I mean, oh man, this is so cool. Get out into your shop, make something cool, and until next time, thanks for watching. Thank you.